supposedly uh, this uh, quote unquote Japanese guy has been doing this, not just in the Philippines, also in other countries. It's not the first time he sent emails threatening bombs in different places. What does the AFP know about the sender? And are we close to figuring out who this is or who this group is? Um, for in the, in the part of the AFP, we have been, uh, we declared this as a hoax. This has been going on for so many years already. It's the same message all over again from previous years. So, but of course, um, living up to our task of securing the people and protecting the state, we will always be there to, you know, react and be wary on these uh, threats that are happening. So, you were able to declare it as a hoax already, Colonel. Uh, these government agencies and these schools, did they do the right thing in, you know, taking the threat seriously and calling for suspension of work and classes still? Yes, um, there, there is no, nothing wrong being, with being very cautious, no? So, even for us in the AFP, if there are these threats, that are, come, are, that are going about, we'll still be reacting to them accordingly. Is this a local threat, would you know, Colonel? Or is this an international threat because they're also sending emails in other countries, not just the Philippines? And um, we understand, of course, that we have to take these threats seriously. Lives are at stake. But, I mean, we can't just keep on going and suspending classes every time we receive an email. Is there a definitive plan to try to, uh, I don't know, capture who's responsible, maybe? For, for this case, there are different agencies that are going, uh, they're doing their role in terms of um, having this cyber cyber attack. This can be considered as one of them. And so the other agencies that are in charge of those would rule this out and move forward from there from here on. You're talking about the DOJ and the NBI? Would they be the yes, other? Yes, that would be. Uh, also... Um, yeah, uh, for our cyber crimes, we have the CICC from the ICT. We have the NBI and the PNP as well. Colonel, kayo po ay ano, cyber security expert. Nalaman uh -huh. namin yan. Ano, uh, <laughs> Correct. Medyo ano, hirap po ba tayo sa pag-track kung saan ng source nito? Um, because you know, in terms of like IP addresses, addresses, do we have a location? or Can we pinpoint to you know a certain, uh, I guess, group? May, mayroon ba tayo nakikita dito na footprints that are familiar? Any more clues? Of course, um, we'll be doing cyber forensics for this, no? So the results of the investigation from the cyber forensics will move forward from there. But it's possible to detect. It will just take some time, even if they use a VPN. But we are also collaborating with different agencies on trying to really find the source of this attack.